Hello, welcome to Game Rating Review. My name is Jean-Marc Lejeune, and today we're talking about Beholder. Beholder was developed by Warm Lamp Games and published by Allware Premium. It was released November 9th, 2016. Beholder is a side-scrolling game where you must follow the government's rules and spy on your neighbors. There's a lot of ways to do this, rummaging through their stuff, setting up surveillance cameras, then you have to write a report. I loved the art of this game. I loved how technical this game is, and I couldn't figure it out, but I knew if I did figure it out, I'd get addicted. I did a half an hour let's play that I split into two, and I was like, man, this is like, complex game like you really have to search your left give them fake letters and stuff and blackmail them and you could buy stuff from the store or from this guy on the street and so it was really interesting i like the characters i i like that you could either be very like not agree with the people or agree with the people in charge i decided to agree because i just want to see how the game goes but yeah it's fun to give you were to get this game and buy it and really dig deep into it, it would be an addiction. And I just didn't know what I was doing when I did a Let's Play. So the first one, I get to see the intro, get to see me kind of grab up for it. And then the second Let's Play, I have no idea what I'm doing whatsoever. I have no idea. So yeah, Beholder, but it's a fun game. If I were to rate this game, oh man, I'm... Mm, See, I didn't get into the gameplay as much as I liked, and I wish there was a way for them to explain to me a little bit better how to play, because he just threw me out there and was like, spy on this guy, and then you'll be done. And I was like, what do you mean? What do you mean, spy on this guy? What do you want me to do? It was very frustrating, and I didn't know how to finish the mission, so I fast forward, hoping, because I set up a camera, I thought he would eventually show up at his house, and he never did. Was I supposed to write a report about the stuff that I stole? I have no idea. I wish I didn't know what I was doing. I should watch someone else's Let's Play to understand what I was doing. But I feel like that's the fault of the game maker. Because he's supposed to make something that's easy to follow. And not something that you're like guessing at the whole time. So like that's not good, right? So I think I'm going to give it a 6. Because I liked a lot of things about it. I just didn't understand it. But I loved it and I wanted to get into it. I wanted to play it and be like, yes, this is a game. <sighs> but it just didn't happen. So gonna give it a six which is low I feel bad but what I played I liked but from what I didn't understand it just didn't and I'm a pretty good gamer I've understood things this one just right over my head I, I don't know I don't know what's going on anymore I have no idea uh, the world is imploding and it just seems like we're more divided than ever and I having nightmares about things so I'm hoping playing scary games will save me from these nightmares and um, hopefully they go away and I hope that I'll be able to sleep a good sleep without thinking about this character that no one likes the, and having dreams about this character that used to be in Game Rain Review got pushed out but I dream about him nightly and it just dis disturbs my dreams and I, I think I miss him controlling my life, telling me, because I'm in control now, and it hasn't been great. It hasn't been great. But play Beholder. I think you would like it. Thank you for watching Game Rating Review. My name is Mark Lejean. Please hit the like, subscribe, button, like you see. And you have all the facts now. Do whatever you want with them. Thanks for watching.